Any other any other questions you got? Yeah, you, I have. You can get your phone out. It's fine. I have another one from leg drag from where I'm finishing leg drag from the yeah. right. So I'll be. I'll show you what's happening. So however I'm setting it up where I'm here, and I'm attaching with this leg yeah. is like it either slides up where it's yeah. here and it feels like awkward okay. sort of come up like this or even if it's here they're putting this leg of the gun they're sort of like jumping around this way like they're building up base and they're like this yeah okay doing that okay let's get shot so you come in uh how are you spinning to the inside um usually from this from this like a are you, are, you, are you going near here far here uh um yeah, usually far hit. Far hit? And what are you doing with this hand in your elbow? Um, that hand I, I bring underneath, yeah. Like you, co this. you come over here, so you're framing? Yeah. Okay, so this frame is really good. If you're going for a leg drag straight away, something that's handy with this grip is that you can block the foot framing on your hip. So if I'm spinning under, okay, if you're just like this, they can push, they can push on your hip. Yeah. Okay, if you're framing under, that stops that really well. But also the benefit of this one is that you can pull them straight into a leg drag. Okay, so you can cut this far hip over here, you come through and you can come straight away yeah okay. you can use both your feet hooking over here and you see how they can't put this foot to the mat yeah okay this stops them from standing up oh, okay. okay if this foot is on the mat and you're kind of a little loose over here so this is a common thing that happens yeah okay then you risk the scramble then pulling you into 50 or coming on top yeah okay so if you keep this one really tight over here okay you don't touch that foot to the mat once you clear this you come up Oh, so you keep it in the air. Yeah, so you want to keep your foot in the air. Okay. Exactly. Okay. And then you really build up with your with your bottom foot. And remember how we kept on talking about staying on your toes? Yeah. That really helps over here. So you're gonna internally rotate this one a lot, so that their foot isn't on the mat. You clear it over here and you come up. But sometimes you have got to acknowledge that in a comp and in a roll, it's like a little messy sometimes. Yeah. So like, you might just be over here. Yeah. Like you have to like kind of just like have a little fuck you and just get up, you know. <laughs> Um, you keep the drawstring grip the whole time. Yeah, I, I don't ever let go of that. Okay. Um, very. I try not to place my hand on the mat. Sometimes that'll just happen. Sometimes you just need to get up fast, and you'll be like, okay, like you're down. I'm pointing. You just need to get up. You know, being yeah. on top is more than finishing the leg. Okay. Okay. But um, right here, if you keep control of this bottom foot, making sure well, they don't touch it on the mat, then um, they're gonna find it hard to like stand up. Okay. Okay. And also the problem you have a lot is that uh, people will suck you into 50. Yeah. So over here, he's tensing really tight over here. So remember how we're talking about really, uh, what do you call it, like flexing your shins really hard? Yeah. You gotta like feel that burn in your shin, okay? Because otherwise then like, like we are talking about the other day, that's gonna fix like 99% of your problems. Yeah. Okay, if you just flex so much, your shins burn, does suck, but um, you know, it'll make it a lot tighter. Yeah. Do you wanna give that a shot? Yeah. 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 So make sure you really frame with this one. So okay, so your elbow, yeah, you're really gonna frame. So what you're trying to do, you're trying to block the path of the foot to your hip. If you're not focusing on blocking the path and your elbow is just there, this isn't gonna make much of a difference. But you've really gotta focus on blocking the path and dragging it into that direction. Okay? Yeah. But you don't need to drag it so far away because then they can turn their hips out and start facing you. Yeah. You're trying to pull my knee and my foot into that pocket. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, so you're trying to get your hip really close to mine and you're trying to direct that foot into that direction. Okay. Yeah, come over here. Little, little tighter on your grip too. So yeah. you, you want to pull yourself in really tight. So you tense your upper body a lot. Nice. You see over there, okay? And you can keep your elbow, you can keep, kind of keep your elbow and your forearm lined up. Yeah, over here. So over here, pull this in, tense really tight, and this knee should be coming all the way up to my belly button. Oh, okay. Nice. Okay, and you see how your feet got a little loose there? Yeah. That's a mistake you don't want to make. Okay, over here, really internally flex it. Maybe it just might be your socks slipping out. But no, no. Okay, so over here, uh, this doesn't feel quite right. Try, try and get to, the, uh, to your other foot as soon as possible. Stay on your toes though. So you see how you're loosening up over there? Stay yeah. tight, stay into me, try and bring your head to the other side. Nice, okay. But try and get to this foot as soon as possible. So okay. benching up on this knee? Yeah, no, on the foot. Oh, yeah. Yeah. If you stay on the knee, then you run the risk of like getting bumped. Okay. But if you stay on your foot, okay, have step your foot high. Okay. There's no risk like that. Oh, just I see. yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, maybe take your set, your socks off and try it like that, so that your foot sticks a little better. Okay. okay so try that. Okay. Pull yourself in. 
Nice. Okay. Now this hand, yep, so you're going to drag it over. So you see, go back. You see how your hand lost connection to my leg yeah. when you went for it? So you, so you went for the grip? You kind of like had this space over here. That's when guys come out. Like this. Yeah. Okay, they'll start stiff arming and going crazy. You got to start, you got to like slide your forearm across my leg. Oh, like that. Yeah. Okay, because okay. you're always thinking about blocking the path, right? Yeah. Okay, if you don't think, if you're not acknowledging like what they're trying to do, then that kind of can like. Yeah, and then pulling this, this yeah. leg out. Yeah. I, I, I wouldn't overthink it, just pull it out. Yeah. Yeah, nice. Okay. Uh, turn this knee, uh, turn your leg more. Yeah, tense really hard, remember? Yeah. Okay, this elbow squeeze tight. Okay, elbow to your rib cage, again okay, to the floor. Nice, that foot, stay on your toes. Nice, step that other foot up. So you're trying to drive all your weight in this direction over here. Okay. Okay, keep your head down a little more, squeeze a little tighter. Nice, okay. Really make sure to lock your elbows too. So, one more thing I forgot to mention. Where, uh, I'll look to you for this one. Okay, so you're coming over here. Training, you're coming over here. You've got to pull really hard with this arm, because what you're trying to do, you're trying to turn that hip in the other direction. Okay, so what's happening right now, it's kind of hard, it's kind of hard for the camera to articulate, or like for them to feel. You're kind of just like, you're kind of just staying here with your head and trying to come over here. Yeah. What you want to do, you want to try and pull, you're trying to pull this, uh, this bottom hip up off the mat. Okay, you're trying to turn it. Okay, yeah, so I can't focus on this elbow too. Okay, so you see how the hand is not just dead under your hip, I'm pulling it up. Okay, that helps me tense everything else. I come down here and I'm staying tight the entire time. There's a lot of like, there's a lot of tension in my body. When I'm yeah. Going. Okay. Okay. Do you want to give that a shot? Yeah, let me go. You just stay. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Don't don't shoot your hand. Try and keep your hand on this side though. If this hand, like you want it, because you're trying to block the leg from coming out. If yeah. this head slips down, then it can potentially slip everything out. Yeah. So you go here and... Then... You're going to just shoot straight forward. Ah, okay. Okay? Okay. Nice. Oh, pull cool my hip. Yeah, that. Nice. Okay. That's a lot better. Try and keep... Uh, and I would also say try and squeeze these inside muscles a little more. I felt you were a little soft there. Okay? So you got to really... Like, you got to contract your whole leg. From your toes all the way up to your leg. Like this. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so you're going to try and, yeah, so, oh, okay, I see the problem. You've got to flex up a, a little more, okay? So you're going to try and keep pressure, keep your knees to your chest over here. Okay, you're trying to really twist my, you can even slide your hook down to my ankle. Yeah. You can do good. Yeah. Sure. Okay. Nice. Turn, uh, turn the inside a little more. Nice. Okay, and really turn your knee. Really turn your knee. Try and twist my leg as much as you can. Nice, that's good tension over there. Uh, I like that. Okay. Okay. Any more questions about that? No, that, that I'm fine. Okay. Have you got anything else that you kind of need?